from Project Fashion and my trust in the Simpsons. Paul! Today we're going to show you how to turn one of my favourite shirts into a lovely dress for Yasmin. What you're going to need is one of your dad's shirts, a t-shirt that fits you, a, a ruler, some chalk or a pencil, some scissors, some pins and a tape measure and a sewing machine. Okay guys, so just a little tip. We need to find the waist of this t-shirt that fits you so well, okay? So just at the top of the hips, okay? Wait, there's your belly button, there's your belly button at the top of the hips. This is your waist, okay? Once you know where your waist is, drop a little pin in there. Then we're going to lay out our shirt flat and find the central point of our t-shirt and line it centrally onto the shirt. So line up the, the shoulders, okay? And then we're going to, we're gonna chalk around it. So you can pin it down at this stage, just so you can get it all very accurate. But I'm not gonna do that. Um, just so I can speed things up a little. So I've chalked all the way around the t-shirt. And when I've come to the underarms here, I've, I've brought, it, brought it out to, to allow for the sleeves. Now on the waistline, if you line your ruler up so it's, you can draw little lines out from here so you know that this is the waistline, okay? So I've taken my t-shirt off and this is the line I have underneath. I'm just gonna continue this line, this from the waistline down to the hem of the shirt, coming out at a bit of an angle, like an A-line, like an A-line skirt, just to give a bit of width at the bottom. And I'm gonna cut on that line now. So if you cut along that line that you've chalked, when you come to the waistline, just make sure that you're leaving a bit of seam allowance from the waistline up. So I'm giving about a centimeter. Do the same with the other side now. So it's already starting to look like a nice little dress. Okay, have a look what that looks like on the waist. Yeah, looking good. So the next thing we've got to do is we need to sew these seams up. Okay, but we don't want to sew them up the right way around. The seams need to be inside. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn it inside out. Sew it up with the seams on the inside. I'm going to pin all along here, pin all my edges together, and then we're going to sew it.
Okay, so we've sewn up our side seams. Now we just need to turn it round the right way. Let's see how it is. Oh, that looks nice. What do you think of that, guys? So, would you like to try that on? Yeah. Wow, love that. That looks fantastic. Are you happy with that? Yeah. Now I'm going to give you some ideas on how to finish it a little bit, okay? So what you can do is you can cut off your cuffs and use your cuff to give you a bit of a dramatic shoulder. Sew your cuff on around here. Give yourself a bit of drama on the shoulder, okay? You can cut off your collars. You can have a little kind of grandfather style collar if you prefer that cleaner look. And you can use the length of this sleeve here to create a belt. So you would cut it, sew it right sides together and pull it inside out and you can use it for a belt. You could even make some bows which I'll show you later on down the line in some more tutorials that you can put on. So well done. So I've decided not to use the cuff here to go over the shoulder to give it that dramatic shoulder. Now you can do that if you want. It's just that I've got this nice ruffle detail at the bottom of the cuff that I've decided to cut off. I'm gonna use that detail to just tuck inside the bottom of the sleeve here. So I just tucked it inside like this and I've sewn it on. Okay, so you can use it any detail, any kind of fabric for that, like, um, you know, ribbon or lace. And cut it to, you know, about an inch in, in size and put it in and sew it in. So here we are, finished dress, upcycled from daddy's shirt. We've got the shape of the t-shirt that we cut it from. We have a plaited belt, which you can see in our bag making tutorial, which was upcycled from a pair of jeans. We have the, the little detail sewn in here onto the shoulders. Are you happy with it, Yasmin? Yeah. Did you wear it out? Yeah. Well, that's proof then that it's, it's working. I'm gonna go and bring up the collars a little bit. You can sew buttons and embellishments onto the collars to bring that to life. And yeah, I think we did a really good job there. So this is our finished item. We blinged up the collars a little bit with rhinestones. So what we want you to guys to do now guys is to go away and make your, your version of it. Send your photographs through to our Instagram page. So hit that subscribe button and bye.